Hey, Doc. I'm on a holiday. I need a coffee, though. Wanna help me? Doesn't look like you're too busy right now. Oh, yeah? Where? Over there? What's over there? Redbeard? Coffee? That sounds like a cup for me. Let's go on over there. Coffee where again? Doc just told me over Redbeard. You agree? All right, I'll go. I'll go try it. Why not just cross street? Beautiful town. I'm over in Dodge City, Kansas. I'm gonna have myself some Redbeard coffee. Let's see what this town has to offer. Probably Boot Hill Distilleries around the corner here. The place is called Red Beard Coffee. Very cool, cool coffee store or cafe. The details, I mean, this, this wood is beautiful. All the fixings you could want, and the table is an old tool chest. So basically, we had we had, had we had set up a church uh, across the street. Me and my two best friends, and we were looking to. I was looking to get out of what I was doing and be able to be home, and be around more, and and ultimately affect our community in a real way. And I'd been kind of looking at a like what that medium was, and I love coffee. It it kind of just hit me one day, and I I felt like the Lord really for us just like really opened up this this. Was had been a music store for 52 years, wow. same store for that long, and they they went out of business. Uh, they'd been out of business about six eight months. Uh, the rent sign kind of finally came up in it. I talked to the owner at the time, and I I asked him about you know renting it and what was going on, blah blah blah, whatever. And uh, yeah, he he said you know. He asked me what I wanted to put it in, and I told him a coffee shop. And he was the owner of the only other coffee shop in town at the time. So needless to say, he would not rent it to me, you know? Yeah, so we, man, it's been a ride. And we, so basically I wanted to start, I wanted to do something so I could be here. And I could be with my family, and I could be a part of our community. And also, not just to be a part of the community, but provide something for the community. Yeah. Like build community in itself. And, and that was what the goal was, and it's what we've done from day one. We've um, built relationships with like local, other local churches, community, community leaders um, from, I mean, from county, from the county and the city, from the sheriff's departments, the, the uh, city police, uh, fire departments. We've, we've kind of just made connections in all those spaces to give them a space and a, and a place to, uh, like, I think represent what the kingdom what I feel like the kingdom of, of, of heaven would look like. Yeah. Um, and I feel like kingdom business from, from that standpoint. And to try to always love people first. Yes. Like, love people. And, the, you know, I mean, like, it's it's so difficult, I think, sometimes in modern day, uh, especially within the organized church, to, there's all these things that, oh, you have to do this, this, and this. If you love God and you love people, the rest really falls into place. Because if you're really doing those two things to their fullest, to, like, the truest form of what they're supposed to be, the rest is semantics, and 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 you can squabble over things, and and and, you, and people get hurt, and, and and it's just messy. When in reality, like love looks like something very real, something very important. Love rules, right? That's right. That's right. And so, what goes, that's, what goes around comes around. Yeah, I mean, but even outside of that, even if it doesn't, like I, I'm not I'm not concerned about that. I know that the Lord will always take care of me, um, and I just. I, I just consider it not, like you know, an opportunity and a, and a blessing to just get to do what I do. Person. Well, the Lord's given me a lot, you know, and and ultimately too, it's like He just has changed my heart, He's changed my perspective. What's your name? Clinton. Clinton. Yeah. Thank you for your time, sir. Yeah, absolutely. I love your shop. Absolutely. I know a lot yeah. of this place.
awesome. Thank you. Thank I, you. I was just walking down the street. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I caught your sign about where that gentleman is over there. Yeah. So I saw the sign. I was just drawn to it. That's so cool. You're doing a great job. Thank, well, you. thank you. Thank no, you. I appreciate it. We're just having fun. Having fun. You're doing it right. Hey, well, uh, we hope so. <laughs> we hope you so. Know so. <laughs>